from Mombasa and aside on that, a lady operating an M-Pesa shop in Changamwe lost her life after an attack by a gang. Police are searching for the killers. Francis Mtalaki, let's now bring you in and I can see you're just outside the police station. What more information do you have for us regarding this murder? What we've been able to gather so far is that uh, the incident happened at around 11 uh, p.m. yesterday at Megadini area in Changamako, in Changamako constituency. And uh, what uh, we've been able to gather from the police is that uh, uh, the 30-year-old the lady was, uh, who has been operating an m shop in Megadini area was attacked by what the police say that uh, it could be a, 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 an armed criminal gang of two people. but. Uh, uh, the police until this moment have not been able to give any leads so far as to any arrests that have been made. But uh, we are here at uh, Tejangamwe police station to find out from the police if they have been able to uh, have or uh, arrest any of the uh, the criminal gangs that have been uh, have, have been said to be operating in Megadini area. But generally from the residents of Changamo area and Mombasa County there seems to be a growing concern on how matters securities are being handled with regard to the a change of tactic by these criminal gangs. Remember uh, the uh, last incident that happened in Kisauni area. They attacked Matatu uh, very early in the morning and this uh, incident happening very late in the evening. And also uh, how the gangs are operating. This is uh, some of the challenges that are coming up from the police uh, of, uh, saying that uh, there seems to be a change of tactics on how the criminal gangs have been operating this area. But uh, uh, what the word from the police is that uh, they're doing what they can to make sure that uh, they narrow down the suspects and uh, being arraigned in court so that uh, they can face uh, the full face of the law. And also what we can be able to gather is that the body uh, has since been taken to cause the general mortuary uh, for, for, uh, for funeral arrangements and uh, the, the, the government side has been uh, working closely with the, the family to make sure that uh, uh, the arrest has been made so far what we, from what we've been able to speak to the, uh, the, the family members uh, but from now we're waiting what from the police and also we'll be heading to the area of the scene to, to make sure that uh, our viewers can be able to get what is uh, happening here in Mombasa with regard to matters security